So over the years, the Fortnite x Five Nights at Freddy's collab has become honestly one of the most anticipated crossovers that people have ever seen in this game. Even though most of the hints regarding the collaboration aren't necessarily like set in stone, but a lot of people really, really want this collaboration, including myself, and it makes a lot of sense to come into the game. So if you guys don't know, over the last couple of days, this um, hype has ramped up a lot, uh, mostly due because of two different things. There was another skin survey that came out where they list a bunch of different um, icons and gaming and TV shows for possible um, collaborations in the future to see what people are interested in. And Five Nights at Freddy's happened to be one of the ones mentioned as it is most of the time on these surveys. But yeah, it was pretty much just mentioned as a collaboration that could possibly be coming to the game because it seems like Fortnite thinks that players have interest in it, so they're mentioning it in this survey to see what people think. And normally that's that. There's really not much said about it other than that, but this time it's a little bit different because Scott Cawthon, the creator of Five Nights at Freddy's and everything involving um, Five Nights at Freddy's, said that they have a big collaboration announced for August 6th, and Fortnite also has a confirmed update on August 6th as well, which is supposedly going to be the last update of the season before chapter 5 season 4. Now even though they said that this update was exclusively for LEGO mostly with the Battle Bus update as well as um, you can skip to the night kind of how you can with sleeping in Minecraft, just some like really like basic additions to LEGO that pretty much should have been in the game um, from the moment it came out. But a lot of people are hyped for that, and I. But people are also linking it towards this new Five Nights at Freddy's collaboration that could be happening um, really, really soon. And it's getting, in my opinion, it's getting really frustrating because Five Nights at Freddy's would obviously be such a perfect addition um, to Fortnite, and especially with Fortnite Mares coming up, it makes sense for them to be involved with this next season. Um, maybe as some sort of mini pass, like we've seen with Pirates of the Caribbean, along with a bunch of other collaborations a mini pass for Five Nights at Freddy's would be revolutionary like it would actually be groundbreaking I think so many people would come back to the game from that that would be like super popular Five Nights at Freddy's is a staple of a lot of people's like gaming childhood I guess and I feel like there's a ton of people that want that to happen but I don't think that August 6th actually makes sense um, for this collaboration to be announced or for it to come out then um, maybe some stuff will be added to the files but Five Nights at Freddy's and Scott Cawthon, they, they hinted towards an actual announcement on August 6th, and I just don't see how a Fortnite collaboration with Five Nights at Freddy's makes sense for August 6th. Like, the timing is just really weird. Um, additionally, there was also a lot of talk around it possibly being a collaboration with Stumble Guys of all games, because apparently there is a lot of stuff in the source code for Stumble Guys that mentions code names like The Night Shift and a lot of Five Nights at Freddy's innuendos that make a lot of sense for it to be in stumble guys and not fortnite not gonna lie like i saw a post on twitter replying to that information that said um scott cawthon is fumbling the bag and that would actually be a huge fumbling of the bag uh if he doesn't decide to collaborate with five nights at freddy's talk about making a lot of money that would make so much money um and it and it would fit seamlessly into Fortnite if Five Nights at Freddy's collab would. Um, I'm just here to debunk. I really do not think that Five Nights at Freddy's is going to release on August 6th because it literally, like I said, it just doesn't make sense. It's in the middle of the summer. If anything, I would expect it more, like I said, during uh, Fortnite Mares in October. And that makes a lot of sense for this next season coming up. Imagine Marvel along with Five Nights at Freddy's. Fortnite loves to mix a bunch of different um, games and a bunch of different like IP over and over again um, and that would make a lot of sense uh, to happen in uh, chapter 5 season 4 come on you were so high and mighty you thought you were gonna easily kill me come on man easy bozo when people come at me like that i take it as an insult like why are you why are you coming at me like that but i'm not gonna sit here and say that i don't believe a five nights at freddy's collaboration will happen because it absolutely I, I don't see how it couldn't I, I i really don't especially with them mentioning it in a Fortnite survey for things that people may want to see it's it, it's bound to happen eventually um in some way Fortnite is gonna get it done and if they are able people a lot of people have um questions about how it would be integrated and how it would be used as a skin. And all I have to say about that is this. 
If they can find a way to put Peter Griffin and the giant chicken in Fortnite, they can put in Five Nights at Freddy's. But that's pretty much all I have to say for this video, you guys. Just a little bit of a debunking of the potential Five Nights at Freddy's and, collab and Fortnite collaboration um, announcement, as well as the release date, because I just simply do not see it releasing or be even being announced on August 6th. Um, more likely than not, it will probably be a Stumble Guys collaboration, unfortunately. But I guess we'll just have to wait and see until that day does come. Let me know if you guys did enjoy this video. If you did, please do drop a like. If you enjoyed this content, be sure to subscribe to my channel to see more of it. Use code PRO0YT, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.